Hello, good evening. Hello, 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 everyone. Can you hear me? Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Hello. hello, hello. How are you guys? How are you? How do you feel today? Oh my God, you don't want to talk? Nelson, how are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Thank you. Excellent. How, how was your weekend? Mm, it was a little hard, a little easy. <laughs> a combination, basically. Yes. <laughs> All right. Yes. Okay. And how about you, Erika? How are you? Hello. <laughs> can you hear me? <laughs> yes, I can. Yes. I'm sorry. I have the, the coming out because I moved my bedroom to another room and I'm... Oh, all with right. A huge, <laughs> <laughs> with a huge, a little close work, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Tell us, how was your weekend? Interesting. Funny. <laughs> like uh, I, I don't know how to explain it, but it's uh, it was different, very pretty different than the other one. <laughs> oh really? Yes. Oh, but did you enjoy it? Yes, a I... lot. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's yes. the most important thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And what about you? How was your weekend? A little busy, uh, but it was great. I liked it too. <laughs> uh, Saturday was. Tiring, but Sunday was relaxing, so 50-50, I guess. <laughs> Do you work on weekend, teacher? Um, not giving classes, but I had like a lot of exams to check, <laughs> you know. No so, <laughs> mm -hmm, yeah. It's like paperwork, but yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's boring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. But here we are, guys. I hope you had enjoyed your weekend. I hope you have enjoyed and relaxed because today is time to work. Who else is there? I can see Carlos. Hello, Carlos. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good night. How was your weekend? I'm working in life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Pretty okay. good. And let's see, let's see, let's see. Did you work on the platform, guys? Ah, my goodness. Did you work on the platform? No, teacher. No? Oh, my goodness. So, everyone. A reminder, platform, okay? I will show you how your uh, score on the platform is. Some of you already finished unit number two, so that's great. But some of you haven't even finished the unit number one. So how is that possible? Remember that we are working one unit per week, okay? So I don't want you to wait until the last moment please okay so work on the platform work on the platform is not optional <laughs> all right i will share with you this course let's see uh give me a second let me open up the platform okay can you see what i'm sharing right now Yes? Yes, yes? yes. Okay, pretty good. So um, we are in the week. Well, you must finish the week number two, right? So look, unit number one, unit number two. Some people haven't finished. Carlos, why didn't you work on the unit number two? Hmm. Yes, this Today. Okay, try to advance, please. Adriana, haven't worked on the unit number two either. 
Ay, Jasmine. What happens? How can I actually? You? <laughs> actually, I tried to 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 do it this weekend, but I, or to be honest, I forget it. So, oh, but you know God. me, I love that dream, and I'm gonna do it at the uh, <laughs> last week. How can yes, I? I'm sorry, how, man, I'm how can I defend you? Imagine if they I need more hours. <laughs> I, I told you. I I don't think you need more hours. You need a full extra day. You need eight days at the week. <laughs> no, but or try... maybe ten. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Now, oh look at the knees. I mean, pretty good. She started already the unit number three. Great, that's the attitude. Beautiful. Okay, Herman, it's finished. Unit number two. Hector, so far so good. Isabel two. Ivan needs to finish unit number two. Yeah, look at this. Jamie, pretty good with the unit number two. Holman, two. Lucy, two. And Magdalena, two. Great job. I liked it. Um, and Magdalena continue working on the unit number three. That's great. Mirna. Mirna hasn't finished unit number two. Yes, Already started. <laughs> no, I had I advanced a few a few minutes ago. I advanced. Okay. I advanced. It's not true. <laughs> I advanced. All right, all right. Continue. I working, finished. No I finished number unit number two. Yeah, but a few minutes ago because I I ah. worked before that that the class starts. Okay, pretty good. Now Nelson, Nelson, look at this, super good. He's even he's even working on the unit number four, pretty good. Don't forget to finish unit number three. Oscar Armando, pretty good. He's still he's working on the unit number three. That's great. And Rosalina, if you see, she already finished unit number two. Pretty good. So. So far, so good, guys. Most of you are working on the platform. Most of you already finished unit number two, so that's great. Um, just remember that I don't want you to leave the platform at the moment, okay? That's the only thing I don't want. Remember, we need to take the exams. We need to uh, have the final exam. So it's better if you work on the platform, I mean, little by little. Okay, some of you already finished even the exam and I can see all of the one, I mean, everybody who took the exam, the midterm, they got 100%, so perfect score, very good job. For the one who hasn't taken the exam, please remember the first exam is in the unit number two. Okay, so take that exam. Now, uh, questions according to the platform? Any questions so far? Yes. Teacher, no? I have a I had a trouble with um the with some uh, exercises, but I I don't have uh, the platform open right now. Okay. I'm finding that. Yeah, found it, and we are going to check it out. So remember, if you find a um, an error of the platform, you can tell me so I can report it. Okay, remember that sometimes, especially when you have to type the platform, I mean, sometimes it can make some mistakes, make right? So if you find it, just let me know and I will report it, okay? Uh, Magdaleno, let me know when you find the exercise, okay? Pretty good. Okay, welcome everybody. Now I can see most of you, very good. Do you remember the topics that we studied the last week? Uh-huh. Oh my goodness. The, the seven R's. Mm -hmm. the, very good. The logistics something. <laughs> The logistic something, okay. Or oh, something logistic. <laughs> uh huh. And you guys, do you remember some of the topics that we studied yesterday? Yes, Magdaleno. I, I found uh, the troubles. 
Ah, okay. I thought the topics, but <laughs> okay, go ahead. Excuse tell. me, excuse me, excuse me. Uh, I found that just now. <laughs> no worries. Go ahead. Tell me which ones. Yes, in the number uh, unit three, number nine. Okay, give me a second. I'm going to open up. Uh, okay, unit three. Number nine. Okay, exercise number nine. You answered the, the whole exercise, but uh, the punctuation is uh, is 15. Hmm. It's not 20. Okay, give me a second because it's a little bit slow. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Um. Hold on. Let me try to do it bigger. Is this one? Yes, is that. Okay. So read about warehouse safety product procedures, then clarify them into the following categories by selecting the letters. Hmm. Okay, so uh, what happens? Number if one, number one. Okay, the second is number. The number one is the second. Number two is third. Number three is second. When you answer the, the three exercises, the platform, um, the, pro, the platform grade you in 15%, 15 point, not 20. Oh, that's true. Look at this. That's true. I don't know what's going on. Okay, but look at this, guys. I'm going to check that. Remember that if, like in the previous exercise, if you completed everything, but there was one mistake of the platform, so you got 90.6, right? No llegaron al 100 porque el ejercicio tenía un mistake. So, para esas personas que no llegaron al 100 porque el ejercicio tenía un mistake, I mean, yo se los aproximo. All right? So, in this case, if you got 9.6 because of the exercise, I will give you the 100%. Because in this case, it's not your fault. It's the platform fault. Pero aclaro, solo se los redondeé a las personas que llegaron acá. Hay personas que tienen 8.8, pero a ellos no se los voy a aproximar porque aquí sí les falta completar algunos ejercicios o sacarse mejor nota en unos ejercicios. The same case here, if it is not giving you, I mean, the full amount of points, in the end, when you finish it, I will approximate it. Ok? So, because in this case, it's because of the platform. All right? So right. Every, every time that you have that issues, please let me know. Uh, we need to report it and that they can fix it. Okay? Any other questions, guys, that you may have about the platform in some exercises? No? Okay, pretty oh, good. I don't have all right, so continue working, please. It is not optional, you have to do it. Now, before starting, I'm going to check attendance. So when you listen to your names, say present. Adriana Escalante. Present. Okay, Carlos Abrego. I'm here, teacher, present. Thank you. Christian Alexander. Present teacher. All right. Erika Yasmin. Present. Okay. Fatima Denise. Fatima Denise. All right. Um, Germán Alexander. Present teacher. Very good. Hector Francisco. Present teacher. All right. Eh, Isabel Hernández. Present miss. Very good. Ivan Guzman. Present. Very good. Jamie Raquel. 
Jamie. All right. Um, Holman Giron. Okay, very good. Lucy Natalie. Present. Very good. Magdalena Escalante. Present. Okay. Mirna Elizabeth. Present. Very good. Nelson Antonio. Present. Okay. Oscar Armando. Okay. Um, Rosalina Alvarado. Present. Very good. Okay. So guys, let's start with the topics that we have for today. I'm going to share the presentation. Can you see it? Yes. All right. So today is May 29th. We are in the week number three, unit number two. So guys, okay, we are in the week number three. That means that you must be working in the unit section three on the platform. Now we're going to review and practice the vocabulary related to the seven R's as well the 3PL. Do you remember what uh, 3PL stands for? Do you remember? Uh-huh. Uh, the... uh, 3PLs are um, a kind of a kind of um, companies who work with other together mm -hmm. for example when when someone just just uh, don't have the liver when don't have um, a way to for distribution Something like that. I, I can explain that. <laughs> but you get the idea. You get the idea. Outsourcing. Ah, like outsourcing. That's the one. And what is the meaning of the letter P and the letter L? Do you remember? Very logistic. Very, Very good. Very party. Exactly. So let's review a little bit just to see if you remember it, okay? Now, this is the class objective. Volunteer for reading it, please. Class objective, participate will be able to express the advantage of the outsourcing and the TPL service provides an ADD connector to their district. Very good. Thank you, Carlos. So we are going to express the advantages. This is something that we started in the previous class. I hope you remember. So let's see some of the advantages. And also we will continue practicing connectors. Also, we studied that in the previous class. I hope you remember. Now, when we are talking about logistics, if you remember, um, some of the most popular companies, right? They work under the seven R's. Do you remember which seven R's do we have here? Yes, right product, right price, right, right customer. Mm -hmm. Condition. Right condition. Right time. Okay. Right quantity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Yes, it's only seven. <laughs> cool. Now, yeah. as a customer, we can think about our favorites or the ones that we consider more, I mean, the most important. Some of you consider that the right product is the most important R. Some of you might think, no, for me, the right price is the most important. Some others can think mm -mm, the right time, that's the most important for me. Some others know for me the right place. So as customers, we may have different opinions, right? But what happens if you know, are not the customer, but the owner? What happens if you have your own business? You, as the owner, 
What do you think? How do you pick the right 3PL for your business? Which one would be the most important for you? What do you think? Uh huh. Any opinions? Maybe to share right customers. Right customers. Right price. <laughs> okay. What else? Right place. <laughs> right place. All right. And you guys. This is my opinion. But, um... Okay. How about you guys? Remember, this is not as a customer. This is as an owner. Imagine that you have your business. Which letter R's will be more important for you? What do you think? Uh huh. Anyone? I, I would me? add. Um, go ahead. Go ahead. Lady first. <laughs> you first. Uh, okay okay for me for me product condition price okay right product right condition and right uh, price yeah. price okay so uh, mirna says right price right place and right customer right right <laughs> okay aha magdaleno how about you I would choose uh, product, customer, and price. Ah, all right. Who else? Uh huh. You as the owner. Anyone? Give me options. Give me options. If not, I'm going to ask individually. All right, individually, let me see, let's see. I'm going to pick two, Ivan. Okay, Ivan, you as the owner, which one would you pick? Mm, for my business, right products, right time, right price. Okay, so, if you see, wow, I have a lot of people saying that the right price is important. Lucy, how about you? Which one would you pick if you were the owner? As, as an owner, um, I would choose the right place. That is because for demand, the demand of the people. Mm -hmm. and right um price okay right quantity and the right quantity all right mm -hmm. pretty good mm -hmm. now if you see some of you have some rights in commons for example right product look it has more in common and also right price so now let me ask you the second question is price the most important criteria to decide on the right 3PL? What do you think? I think no, miss. Okay, because why not? Because sometimes, sometimes the people uh, like to write quantity and write time for the, for the products. Mm, Not okay. only, only the price, the price. Uh, maybe yes is very important but sometimes no it's more important the the quantities and the condition mm. of the products okay that's a good point what about you guys what do you think is price the most important criteria in my opinion yes the share is a price why the, because you have a lot of competitors in the market and if you have a good price, you have a good you have a good product and good price, you you will sell, but because you have a lot of competitors. 
I think. Mm -hmm. That's a good point too, right, Price? But it must be, comp uh, I mean, dealing it in together with the right product. Because imagine if the price is very high, very expensive, and in the end you don't have a right product, oof, that would be a problem. So the point of view will change depending if you are the customer or if you are the owner. It's going to change what kind of business you have and what goals you want to reach, okay? Pretty good. So please don't forget the seven R's. Don't forget the meaning of them. Now, continue talking about logistics. We are going to read, okay? I'm going to do it bigger. Give me a second. Okay, who wants to read? Me? Ivan? I want to. Me? Yes. Oh. <laughs> okay, I heard a lot of people. Ah, thank you. I love that you want to read. So I have Ivan, you will be Bob. Who else? Give me the name. Who else? Nelson said first. Nelson, thank you. Okay, Nelson, you will read the part of Daisy. Okay, guys, go ahead. Okay. There is no more room in our house for more of your organic soup. Don't you think it's trying to take business uh, off of the house? I found something called Enter Perry Logistics on Google. The service could help help you out with the storage. Okay. I don't think so, Bo. As far as I know, the business is not big enough to hire a third party service. To the best of my knowledge, the soup is selling like crazy. And I, and I believe in cool help helps us to sell more. Well, it was actually thinking of outsourcing the package. Choose a couple of those companies from the internet and then we can call them to get some advice. Advice, thank you. All right, now everybody pay attention. In English, there is something that is linking sounds. That is basically when we join the last sounds in each word to sounds more fluent. For example, uh, imagine here, more room. What is the last sound here? What is the last sound? R. More. What is the more. next sound? More. R. R. So basically more. we have the same sound. So instead of saying more room and separate the words, we can say more room. It's the same sound, don't interrupt it. Then it's ending in the letter M and I have a vowel here. So we can say there is no more room mean and then we can join it. So there is no more room in our house. Did I separate the words? Look at the difference. If I say, there is no more room in our house. Or if I say, there is no more room in our house. Look, I don't separate the sound. And this is exactly what we do in Spanish too. So every time that you see consonant and the vowel, you can join them. Okay, it's the same example here. What will be the pronunciation here? Can I say your organic soup? Or how can I say that? Your organic soup? Aha, uh -huh. look at the difference. So it's time, I'm sorry, for more of your organic soup. Your, we don't separate the words. Your, okay? Your. And you can do the same every time that you can see consonant 
and vowels. What will be the pronunciation of the sec uh, third sentence? To take business out of the house, or what will be the pronunciation? Business out of the house. Ah, look, I have the letter S. Business out of the house. Business out of the house. So we are just linking all the sounds to take business out of the house, okay? And we can do this in all of the sentences where we can have consonants, vowels, okay? Try to do it. That is going to help you to sound a little bit more natural. So what is the business about in this conversation? That's their part of logistics. What is the product that they are trying to sell? Organic soup. Organic, Organic soup. soup. Organic soup. <laughs> It sounds a, lot, a little attractive, right? So, are Bob and Daisy having problems to store their products? Organic soup. So, do they have problems with the store? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, right? What happens with them? The logistics. Uh -huh. Exactly, they don't have more storage. They don't have more room for them. So it's a good idea if they, look, outsourcing. outsourcing. Yes, they need another company to help them to do the job. So let's try to remember about what does 3PL mean. As some of your classmates says, third, body logistic and in the previous classes we studied the different uh, well the difference between one party logistic two and three i need a volunteer please for explaining the number one what happens in the first party logistic don't read tell me with your own words volunteer okay one okay. Okay, uh, Ivan and Magdalena, you can explain the number two. Aha, uh -huh, Ivan, tell us. Uh, number two. Number one. Okay. A business manufacturer TV packs, stores, and delivers indirectly, directly to customers. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, now what you, is uh, that? Aha, uh -huh, explain us. What is that? It's the it's the same the the the, the channel di direct direct channels direct channel similar similar direct channel mm. the 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 factory uh, sending uh, directly in the customers. Okay, everybody, do you agree? The company uh, produces the the products. In this example, TV. Mm -hmm. Yes, I agree. Totally. Very good. Exactly. As Ivan said, right? In this case, the company does everything. The manufacturing. Then they pack the product. Then they store the product. They deliver the product. So they do everything. So yes, this is like a direct channel. The communication with the customer is direct. How about the number two, Magdaleno? Yes. Go ahead, explain us, what is that? The second is when, when the, the factory can man, uh, can manufacture their own product. They pack, their stores, their sales. And the trouble is they don't have a delivery. And they have to contract to find uh, outsourcing for sales their product. And then they need a courier. Courier is the people who deliver the, 
everything. That's the one. That? Yes, perfect. So the second party logistic, as your classmate said, right? The company does the manufacturing, they package, they store, but they have a problem. They don't have the option of transportation or delivery. That's why they hire to another company to do that job. In this case, look, the communication to the customer is not direct. How many parties are involved in order to get to the customer? Look, one, two. That's why the name. Now I need a girl, only the boys answer. So I need a girl to explain me the number third, please. I mean, the number three, third party logistic. What is that? Can, can I? Of course, go ahead. And third party logistic is when you, and when you, when a business uh, just manufacture the, the, the things or the product and they need to, contract or outsourcing and transport warehouses and packaging and for distribution, uh, the retails or, or the wholesale. Mm. And, it, and this is the meaning that three party logistics because you need three, three, three step or three thing that, that when you, when you are uh, a manufacturer and you need to three, three part of absorbing. Correct, as simple as that. In this scenario, remember, as your classmate said, the main company, they don't do all the job. Maybe they only manufacturing the product. That's all what they do. So then they hire to another company to package the products. They hired another company to storage the product or to warehouse the product. And they hire another company to deliver the product. So in this case, how many steps or how many companies do we have involved in order to get to the customer? We have three. That's why the name, three party logistic. So, is it clear the meaning of third party logistic? Yes? Yes, yes it is. Everybody? Yes? Yes, of course. Cool. Remember, this is a review. I'm just checking and verifying if you remember. Now, we have here some vocabulary related to, uh, to logistics, okay? And we are going to match the terms with the correct definition, okay? So everybody, let's read it. Uh, let me try to do it bigger. Just give me a second. Uh, uh, okay, can you see it? Yes? Yes. Pretty good. Okay, let's match it. For example, transportation. Hmm, what would it be that? I'm going to give you three minutes, read the definitions, and then we are going to verify if the answers are correct or not. If you have a question with the vocabulary, tell me and I can explain. Go ahead. I will be asking individually, so read carefully. Do you know that that's the key? Read carefully. If you had a question, just let me know, please.
Teacher, what means, what does mean freight? Freight. Okay. In this case, guys, freight, we are talking about merchandise or transportation. That is the meaning for freight. It's a synonym of merchandise or transport. If you have a question, tell me, please. Remember keywords. You had to identify the keywords. You ready, everyone? No tissue. <laughs> yes. Okay. One minute, please. <laughs> okay, I will give you more time. No worries. Breathe carefully, please. Teacher, what mean investment? Investment? Where is it? Oh, this one? Yes, Inve it is. Okay, investment is the money that you invest on something. So in this case... It's, it's a noun. It's a noun, yes. Invest is the verb. Investment is the noun. So it's the money that you invest on your... In this case, a vehicle or in a no. house. Mm -hmm. uh, hi, everyone. You ready or not yet? Read carefully, read carefully. Try to identify the keywords. That's the idea. If you have a question with the vocabulary, just let me know. I will give you one more minute. Okay, ready, everyone? 
Yes. Yes. Ready. Okay. Everybody, are you ready to? Ready. Ready? Perfect. Yeah. Yes. Oops. <laughs> okay. Uh, transportation. Volunteer for reading. What is that? Your show. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I want to I want to I want to give you one. <laughs> yeah. But is it the correct <laughs> the physical person? Okay, can you read it please? Yes, can I? The the physical process of transporting commodity commodities and merchandise goods and cargo. Okay, commodities. Commodi commodities. Yes, merchandise, goods and cargo. Perfect. Now, private fleet management. Hmm, what is that, everyone? A, a function that allows companies which rely to remove or minimize the risks associated with vehicle investment, hmm, I think. Okay. Everyone, do you agree or do you have any other idea? I agree. I agree, I agree with that. Okay. I don't know, That's but right. maybe. Uh -huh. ah, okay. I don't know. All right. Yeah, right. So remember, private fleet, the companies, right? They organize everything. They try to minimize all the risks so they can have their vehicles in good st state. Okay. A freight claim insurance. Hmm. Interesting. What is that? In my opinion, it's a protection. Oh, okay. Uh, some of you say provides protection against all risk. Magdaleno, you were saying? Uh, I said a legal demand by a shipper to, uh, to a career for financial compensation for a loss or damage of a uh, ship. Hmm. Okay, so we got two options here. Everybody, what do you think? I you have this one. I, think I agree it's... with Magdalena. Me too, Magdalena. Yes. Me too, teacher. I agree with Magdalena. It's a legal demand. Are you sure? Yes. Mm -hmm. sure. Yeah. <laughs> we are sure. <laughs> with with your life. <laughs> Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, ah, the, the, the word key. Uh huh. The, the key, key is claim. Is claim. claim. Key, ah. You see, now you are uh, you are learning to read carefully. You are learning to identify the keywords, and that's guys, that's the key for reading comprehension, as your classmate says. Claim. What is the meaning of claim? In Spanish reclamo. Exactly, just like that. So if you are claiming, is because that is a legal okay. demand in this case. Okay. Now, cargo insurance. Hmm. It provides protection against or mm -hmm. risk of physical loss or damage to freight. Okay. Anyone, what do you think? Yes, yes I agree. Are you sure? I agree. I agree. Yes, I, agree. Yeah. Yes, I am. I am, I am possible. Ah, <laughs> that's of what course. I want. That confidence <laughs> is the ones that I need, guys. Cool. Correct. So what is the key word? In cargo insurance? Mm, protection. Yeah. Remember, if we are talking about insurance, what is this? Hmm? What is the meaning of insurance? Seguro. Exactly. So if we are talking about insurance, we are talking about protection. Protection. Exactly. So the last one, small package service, volunteer for reading, please. 
me, teacher? Yes, go ahead. Envelopes or package shipments that weigh less than 150? Exactly. In this case, in English, we say libras in wow. English. Pounds, pounds. 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 Very pounds, good pounds. job. Excellent. Okay. Now, if you remember, all of these terms are related with the logistic. And we are talking about the third party logistics. So now let's see if you remember what are some of the three advantages of hiring 3PL. We studied that the previous class. So let's see if you remember extra points for the ones who remember. Uh -huh. Advantages. We studied three. Which ones do you remember? I remember that the expertise that the the, this this company have in the market. The Do you mean the experience? Experience or they are experts. Sorry, they are experts in the in the logistic, for example, or transportation. And the is it the that I remember? Is it one of the three? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. We explained that they are experts in the area, right? So they do their job in a perfect way so they can improve customer satisfaction. What is another um, advantage? Let's see if you remember, guys. I remember the costs. Uh huh. What can you tell about it? I remember what the, when, for example, for lo logistic or transportation, when a company um, have a outsourcing for transportation, they don't have to. They can rely. They can rely for uh, mechanical services, for pay for trucks and other things. If they pay outsourcing for a warehouse, they don't have to to pay a big warehouse. Mm -hmm. Is that? Basically that, exactly. They can reduce the cost. Perfect. Uh -huh. And the last advantage, who remembers that? Hmm. Oh my goodness. Maybe in financials. <laughs> uh-huh. What can you tell me about it? Okay, I will I give you I will give you a key. International transport. Oh the, uh, the, the expert for the paper <laughs> on the border. I don't remember uh -huh. what is the word, but I remember for, for the paper, the paper. What we the um, the norms the I don't know how was how was the name of these papers, <laughs> but, but you got the idea. People have contact in the border. Mm -hmm. Yes, people have contact, and for they it's easy. It's exactly. easy to to do a, a trimming. That's it. So everybody remember it. Some of the advantages. The third party logistic service improve customer satisfaction because they are experts. Also, it reduces costs, right? Because as your classmate explained, it is cheaper, uh, cheaper to rent transportation than to buy a full fleet of trucks. And the last one, right? If you see, they provide, or oh, well, they eliminate all the issues in the border. So, it is easier for them to transport internationally, not only in one country. Those are the main advantages. Is it clear, everyone? Yes, any questions yes. about the advantages? Yes. Pretty good. Okay, yeah. imagine, si esto hubiese sido un examen, did you pass the exam? First. <laughs> oh my goodness. Could you teacher could you back the the the, the first uh, 
this one please yes thank you you're welcome so thank guys you. try to review the topics okay i don't want you to come here and just remember the day and the next day you forgot everything so try to review it okay uh, can i move yes let me know when you finish yes yes sure. yes okay. sure. perfect yes, a screenshot all right nice okay now let's continue talking and practicing now few classmates were talking in the first hour in the second hour i want to everybody talk okay so we were talking about connectors do you remember connectors yes only one says yes. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> yes Thank you. Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, let's see if it is true. If I want to talk about sequence, which connectors can I use? First. Uh huh. Second. <laughs> Third. <laughs> the most common thing. Yeah, first, Four. second. Yeah. And the last one. And the last one, then. Before and yeah. after. Ah, very good. Finally. Very after good. That. Exactly. I can see you remember. Very good. Very good. Now, if I want to talk about you know, examples, if I want to provide examples, which, which ones can I use? For example. <laughs> for example, for what example. else? For, for instance. Ah, very good. Now, let's talk about adding information. I remember oh, besides. Oh, Rosalina, can you repeat? Besides. Besides. I remember. Mm -hmm. What else? Also. Also. And. However. however. And. Mm, however. Can I use however to add information? No, no, no. Mm, no. Not really. No. However, no, no. it's for making. You a say contrast. Contrast. Exactly. contrast something. <laughs> Correct. Which other can I use in making a contrast? Besides, yeah. however, the other, mm -hmm. but I think, but in the but, same way, however, uh huh. On the, the other, other hand, hand, on the other hand, look. So, however, but on the other hand, although those are like the most common ones that we can use to show contrast. How can I identify that is a contrast in the sentence? What do you think? I remember that when you have to think to compare the first and the result is mm. another, another thing. <laughs> All right. Imagine that I have this sentence and you tell me if I need a contrast or not. If I say, I love pizza. Da, 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 da. I bought one. Do you see a contrast in these sentences? Yes, they uh, it have this have. So does it make sense if I say I love pizza, but I bought one? Does it make sense? Do we have contrast? No, no. no. Really. You love pizza and you bought one. Yeah. Ah, so how can I uh, identify the contrast? And this is the key. One sentence is in affirmative. And the, the other, other one, negative, you say. Exactly. So imagine if I say, I love pizza. I didn't buy one. Do we have a contrast here? Yes. So yes. does it make sense if I say bad? I love pizza, but I didn't mm -hmm. buy one. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So it is important to identify, guys, the contrast. Because it's different when I add information. In, ex in the same example, I love pizza. Ta, 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 ta. 
I but one. So in this case, I don't have contrast. I'm just adding information. What is the information that I am adding? That I bought one. So which of these connections can I use here? Can I say, and I bought one? Does it make sense? Yes. 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 Can I say, so I bought one? Yes. Yes. Definitely. Why? Because I am adding information. information. That is the it, difference. It could, be, it could be a sequence too. Because I love pizza. Uh, and, oh no, wait. Yeah, it could Actually, be a sequence. I love pizza and then I, I, I bought one. That's true. Mm -hmm. Imagine in this case could be a sequence of events. I love pizza. So you can say later, I bought one. In this case, you can add more information if you want to be like more coherent about the sequence of events, right? But in this case, the most important is that you are just adding more information. And in the second one is contrast. Be careful because identify the contrast it is important if you want to use the correct connector. Now, how about if I want uh, to give time because the question is difficult, you need time to think. Which phrases can I use? Give me a break. Give me a break. Let's mm. see. Mm -hmm. Let me. A second. Just a second, <laughs> just a moment. Uh -huh. Very good. So be careful with give me a break. That is more like an idiom that we say when we need to take a breath, right? When you are a little bit tired and some people is like asking more and more things. For example, imagine that a um, how can I explain this? Imagine that you are at work and your supervisor is giving you a lot of homeworks, like, hey, do this. You have to do this other thing. And Tom, hey, a lot of tasks. You haven't even finished the first one when you have a lot of like 10 documents that you need to complete, for example. And your supervisor arrives and say, hey, here, there is another one. So you say, hey, come on, give me a break. Okay, so this is like, hold on, I need to take a break. Give me a second to, to breathe, okay? That's a little bit different. Now, giving opinion, which one can I use here? In my opinion, in my point, in my point of view. Uh-huh. In my opinion. In my point of view, what else? I believe. I believe. Uh huh. As far as my, I know. As far as I know. In my experience. In my experience, pretty good. I think. I think as far as I understand. So. It's the most common one is like, I think, okay? Uh, I think, yeah, that is the most common one, but let's try to use others. So we are going to have a practice, okay? I'm going to show some sentences. Again, we need to identify the correct word to complete the sentence. In this scenario, we are going to use only these ones. And, but, so or because those are the only ones that we will use okay so let me open up the sentences you have to get all the answers correct so can you see the sentences everyone yes yes, yes. pretty good okay look at the number one i call tom but but, but. But. but he didn't answer. Are you sure? 
Yes. Yeah. 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 Uh -huh. yes. <laughs> I don't have any doubt. I like that. I like that. That confidence. That's what I need. Very good. Volunteer for reading the number two, please. I'm tired because I went to bed very late. So okay. Do you I agree? I think we go. And you guys? Do yes. you agree? So yes, I'm tired. My... Uh huh. I I think that it is so? uh, end so. end. No, it's so. Oh, mm. end. Mm -hmm. So ah. Uh, so, so, so is I'm very tired. Good. I went to bed. I'm tired. So because mm -hmm. it's qué, no? I don't know. Yeah, you so. tell me. <laughs> oh, it's so. I, so is the I went. I went. Oh. I went to bed very late. I'm tired, so I went to bed very, very late. Mm -hmm. It's past mm -hmm. when it's, it's past. past. It's because, uh -huh. it's, oh, because it's, it's the best. best. Yeah. I'm tired because yeah. I went I'm, I'm very tired. late. tired. It's past time, yes. And went to. So it's, it's a similar reason. Okay, the, because, because it's, it's similar a reason. Okay, the partners. <laughs> but which you, one, try one you, you try to explain. You try to explain. the reason. The we be careful. The <laughs> Remember. Uh, I'm, I'm confused. Can you read the rules again? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back. Why not? Look. So, guys, identify the kind of sentence. Am I using a sequence? Am I adding information oh. or am I making a contrast? That's what you need to identify here. Am I adding information? Am I providing a contrast? What am I doing here? Or am I giving a reason? That's what okay. you need to think. No. Giving reason, giving reason, contrast, add information. Yeah, it's reason. Giving reason. Okay, so because, are you sure? Yes, yes. It's, it's yeah, the yeah, answer yeah, for yeah. why. Okay. Consequence. Uh -huh. Erica, right. don't cry, Erica. <laughs> we are going I'm to see I'm the. I'm confused the because I'm confused because in the rules of the uh, of the uh, exercise, she says but so and or, but not because. What happens is that because is not in this box. Remember mm -hmm. that because is just when we want to give. Why? The, to answer the reason why. That means to provide reasons. And that is the option that is not here. Okay? But remember, because is to give reasons. Like when you answer the question, why? Now, the number three, volunteer for reading the number three. It was very late. So we took a text. Mm -hmm. so, Everybody? Mm -hmm. Do you agree? Yes. 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 Are you sure? Yes, yes I'm sure. <laughs> ah, yes. In some sentences, you say yes. In some sentences, you are like, eh. <laughs> All right, my gosh. Okay. No I, need a, I need a volunteer. Please give me a name. You can go by us. Can I? Yes. Oh, Thank you, Mirna. Go ahead. You can go by, by mm -hmm. bus or by train. Yep. Mm -hmm. Do you agree, time. everybody? Yes. 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 Ah, yes. yes. yes I do. Cars. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Ah, that's it's okay. what I want. <laughs> okay, Mirna, pick one of your classmates. Uh, <laughs> Fatima. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, Fatima, go ahead. She got into the car. Um. So left. Uh huh. Everybody, do you agree? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which one? And left. You got into the car. Okay. Some of you say so. Some of you say mm -hmm. and. So and. 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 No, in my opinion, is and. She and? got into the car and left. Y se fue. Yeah, <laughs> yeah maybe it's M. Are you M, sure? Yeah. 
Yes. She got yeah. to and, the car and, and left. And she left. Got, she got, se she fue. got into the <laughs> car and left. Y se okay. fue. Ah, <laughs> In Spanish, y se fue. In good Spanish, no. is, is right. Okay. In Spanish, y se fue. Pero se fue. Claro, claro, güey. Oh, but left. <laughs> but left. <laughs> no, and no. And... But okay. Left, better left. <laughs> I don't know. The, we will see the, that. The idea of the statement is she into the car and then she go into the car. Uh -huh. And that... the word into is uh, confuses. Oh, what happens, guys? Into is just like inside. Right? Yes, it's right. She got inside the car. Okay. And I don't know what happens, right? I don't know. I cannot say the answer. Fatima, can you pick one of go. your classmates, please? <laughs> uh -huh. Let's go. And let's go. Okay. Adriana. Adriana, thank you. Number six, please. I called you. Because. Hold on, Adriana. Are you there? Sorry, uh, maybe I called you because I was worried. Okay, everyone? Yes. yes. It's a reason. It's a Are reason. Sure? It's a yep. reason, yeah. Completely sure? Yep. Absolutely. Mm, yeah. <laughs> okay, Adriana, can you pick someone, please? Ivan, thank you. Okay, Ivan, number seven. Go ahead. Mm, would you like to do it now or later? Everybody, what do you think? Yes. Yes. Are you sure? Yes. 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 Yep. Yes. 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 Of course. Yes. Of course. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> okay, Ivan, pick someone. <laughs> Okay, let me check, let me check. Fatima, go ahead. Oh, she already passed. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, pick someone else. Okay, Isabel. Thank you. Okay, Mr. Hernandez, number eight, please. She can. Hello? Isabel, are you there? Hello, hello. Okay, I think that he's not there. Okay, volunteer number eight. Hey, Herman. Thank you, Herman. Go ahead. She can sing, but she can dance. Hmm. Do you agree, everyone? Yes. Yes. Yes, because it's a contrast. <laughs> it's a contrast. Ah, it's a contrast. One positive yeah. and one negative. Now you are um, identifying the contrast. <laughs> <laughs> Rosalina, can you read the number nine, please? No, me, please. <laughs> I was hungry. Oh, I oh. wasn't. I wasn't. Excuse me, Magdaleno. Thank you. I wasn't hungry, but I didn't eat. Uh-huh. Everybody, do you agree? No. No, no, no. no. no sorry. So, so, I didn't eat. So. Okay. But, uh, oh, because <laughs> <laughs> it's a guess, man. I wasn't hungry, so I didn't eat. Yes. Do you agree, mm -hmm. everybody? Because yes. or because but, I wasn't hungry because I didn't eat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. So that's mm -hmm. the only one so, that I'm completely so, sure. Uh -huh. <laughs> I get personally. Personally, I get hungry when I don't eat. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> But guys, please, please give me food every day. Look, wasn't. It's, it's negative. Not it's not saying that he's hungry. It's saying that it wasn't hungry. Mm -hmm. So wasn't. does it make sense that I say, hey, I wasn't hungry because I didn't eat? Does it make sense? No. Mm -hmm. no, no. No. So. So. What is, so, so. so. Are you sure? Yes. 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 Yeah. yeah. Sure. I hope so. I did it. <laughs> uh -huh. The last one. <laughs> and. It's terrible. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yep. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Yes. <laughs> With Erica's life. <laughs> okay. Now, guys, here oh, we got the know. answers. Oh, let me try to do it there. Okay. Are you sure that these are the correct answers or would you like to change one? It is okay. Yes. Uh -huh. I like that. Nelson Confidence says, no, all of them are correct. <sighs> yes. Said it. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. One mistake, one extra homework. Okay. Come on. So, no, no, I don't. <laughs> okay. where, extra homework, no. But where is your confidence? Come on. Okay. One mistake, one homework. Teacher, I think nine and three were. Have a mistake. Okay, number three. Ah, and the ones that I was very late. Three so and nine. Took a taxi. Nine. Hmm, what do you think about the number three? Is that correct, guys? It's past. Is correct? Yes, it is. Yeah, it is. And the it number nine? Correct. Also. Correct. <laughs> okay, I like Nelson. Sounds very confident, guys. I like it. Okay, one mistake, one homework. Ta -ta -ta -ta. <gasps> wow. Ah. Look mm. at this, everyone. You <laughs> no did more, it great. No, <laughs> no more homework. Not for <laughs> now. Not for now. So, the analysis that you just did, that's the correct one. You need to identify the kind of sentence that you are saying in this case, okay? Now, we already practiced grammar. Let's try to practice speaking. It's time to apply the knowledge. You have the information in your mind. You already have these words in your mind. You already understand the meaning of these words. It's time to take that knowledge from our mind and put it into our mouth, okay? Let's start with something simple. Imagine that I have these questions. How efficient is the transport system in your city? How can we answer that question using connectors? I need a volunteer, please, for reading the short paragraph. Uh -huh. it is well, okay, uh, I heard Nelson first. Thank you. Well, if we're talking public transportation, we have many different types of transport. For example, trans buses, buses trains, and middle. So, I think it's quite efficient. In fact, I believe we have one of the most efficient public transport system in Europe. Europe. However, Europe. Thank you, teacher. However, regarding private transport, there are many problems. All right. So imagine, in this case, we are just answering this question. Can you help me guys to identify the connectors in this paragraph? And the second well, paragraph, so. Okay, we got so. What well else? Well is the first, for example. example. Well, I think. for example, in fact, what else? I think, however. I believe, I think, however, I believe. Only those ones? How many connectors do we have in this sentence? I mean, in this answer? Mm -hmm. Look, we got- How many, how many have do you said? How many connectors do we have in this example? We got one, no. two, two, three, three four, six. five, Six, seven. seven. 
Is this a long answer? No. No, it's very short. So this is exactly what we are going to do. I have some questions right here. I want you to answer the questions, but now I want you to think in your answers. No respondan solo por responder. Because what I need is that in all of your sentences or in all of your answers, you have to use, look, how many connectors? Three or four. Three or four. Now, in this moment, let's just stop thinking about fluency. I don't want you to talk fast. No, I want you to use the connectors. For example, how important is learning languages? You have to use at least three or four and you can start. Well, what else can we use to start? Well, I think. I think yeah, learning. I'm ah, very good. Well, I think, or well, in my opinion, solo ahí ya tienen dos. Then you can continue with the sequencers, right? Well, in my opinion, I think <laughs> learning languages is pretty important. Given reason. Because, well, firstly, it's going to help you to develop your mind. Then it's going to be a great advantage if you want to get a new job. Finally, if you want to travel to another country, they, is, they are going to help you a lot. So just imagine in that quick sentence, you use around four or five connectors. So that is exactly what I want. Every time that you answer these questions, try to use connectors. Got it? Yes? Yes. <laughs> is it clear, <laughs> everyone? Yes, yes, yes. Where is the confidence? Yes. You were so yes, confident a yes. couple of minutes before. Where is the confidence now? Oh my goodness. Good work. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> you can do it. Do you like to speak in English? Yes or no? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> So that is what we are going to do now. We are going to speak in English. So now listen, if your classmate answered the question but didn't use any connector, you had to tell them, hey, you forgot the connector. So do it again and try to include connectors, okay? I'm sending the questions on WhatsApp's group. You can do it, guys. Don't give up, you can do it, okay. I'm sending it on WhatsApp's groups. Can you see that? Yes. All right, I already That's send true. it. Now let's go to practice. You will be in team of three. So I want to everybody participate, please. I know that we are going, to, we have some listeners, but the ones that are not listeners, practice, please practice. Let me just create the groups. Give me a second. Ooh. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what was that? <laughs> okay, pretty good. Okay, the groups are ready. Let's go to practice everyone. Three or four connectors, okay? Let's go. Teacher. Yes, Hello, Hector. Teacher. Uh, I continue with my, my report. Is necessary join to, to the main uh, little group? Well, if you are not going to participate, it's not necessary. No worries. I think no. Or, uh, or just if you almost, almost, almost finishing? Eh, casi termino, pero me faltan unas dos páginas. Okay, in that case, join to the groups so you can listen to your classmates. And when you're okay. ready, okay. you can participate. Okay? Okay. 
Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Hello. It's nobody. Ah, oh, Rosalina, hello. How are you? Nobody there. <laughs> yeah, I don't know where your classmates are. No worries. Let me join you to another team, okay? Okay. Yeah, don't worry. Give me a because second. Are you? Trying. Yeah. All right. Only 15 days for the games. <gasps> It's Yay. a lot of work. In a, oh, yeah, you imagine. So is, is the stadium ready for that? Excuse me? Is the stadium ready for that? No. <laughs> Not ready. <laughs> My you son can ready? come today. Really? He's happy, yeah. Aww. But that come at uh, 1 p.m. and he sleep and, and, didn't, and didn't wake up. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, he must be tired. I talk silent. <laughs> He's so tired. I but imagine. 5 a.m. training. Oof. Do you believe me? Oh, yeah, Ooh, that's baby. hard. Yeah. But, oh, but I feel I, I feel nervous. <laughs> yeah, me too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, 5,000 people come the next week. Oh my gosh. All that is huge. I don't know what happened with us, but. <laughs> well, let's. Keep all, faith. All, and... all world think El Salvadorian is the best. Ah. El Salvador is the best. There is a problem. <laughs> That's because, great. Uh, the people outside the country have a lot of expectative. Yeah. You know? mm. So it's there nice. is a lot of uh, weight on our shoulders as Salvadorians. I, I know. It's so much <laughs> for me, but I hope so. I, I believe in God. It, yeah. It, it is finish and it may be some problems problem but i'm trying everything will be fine you will see I that so. yeah okay miss excuse <laughs> me but i i need to talk with you no worries i loved it because thanks for sharing that i stay very silent because it's, it's so hard Today i know nothing. you have a lot of things in your mind yeah. i know yeah. Oh, yeah carlos come you put carlos carlos you there I think he's listener. Okay, I will join you to another team. Llegaron del next ya? Excuse me, teacher. No worries. No worries. With the other person in your mobile. Yes. Yeah, that's true. One of the advantage, as you said, but for me, for example, is when uh, when you can communicate with people that is not next to you i mean if he, he or she lives in europe for example um you can connect or talk with that people with a person that a specific person but one for me or in my opinion one the uh, uh, one disadvantage is, or one disadvantage is you go away from the from people who is next to you because you are always on your phone for example in, in my case I, uh, my little sister she's always on the phone we are <laughs> at the dinner which i don't use it don't use it but she's not i'm doing homework okay, that that's what she said but <laughs> we know that <laughs> she's chatting but it's it's take uh, a little bit away from the people who is next to you. That's what I mean. That's that's in my opinion. Yeah, yeah that's what I saw. Yeah. Uh, Rosalina is here. Oh, Rosalina, hello. Hi, Rosalina. Nice to see you again. Hi, how are you? Excuse me, a little, a little. Please give me five minutes because I need to answer the phone. Please. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. No okay. worries. <laughs> okay, number three, say what can people do do to protect the environment? All right. Okay. Well, in well, my opinion. <laughs> in my opinion, <laughs> in my point of view, <laughs> uh, that people can to do to protect the environment is not uh, not waste or recycle, recyc recycle the products recycle. that they wet. Yes, maybe you in your home, you can have to, maybe you can have two, three canes 
and and three, you three, can three, three can, canes, uh, ah, canes ah. or bottles. That's we no. reuse, reduce, recycle. Yes, you, you, uh -huh. I think that I, I think that in my opinion you can uh, that people can do to protect the environment is is between the the recycle the recycle the the product that you waste uh, for example is is bottle plastic or 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 glass or you you have to you have to do this in in your house I think. It's, or I believe that you you can you can that people uh, can improve the, or can protect the environment that that way. I that, think that's so. yeah, that's interesting. But how you ever uh, hear the history from Bangladesh? Too uh, take a uh, como sería desde que se desconcent no es se distraen. I don't know how to say distraen. Um, this is, uh, focus, uh, un focus. <laughs> distract, 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 distract for distract, for, for, distract, mm -hmm. distract. Ah, okay. This distract. distract for uh, distract of the of the way, and maybe have a a, a big crash or accident. I don't know how to say. And another another that. This this one, advan no this, oh, disadvantage disadvantage disadvantages uh huh this one this advantage uh, lost lost uh family family hours maybe because the people see or saw uh, Facebook Twitter Instagram and and lost uh. Quality hours. I don't know if is do you say quality hours? Family quality hours. Uh-huh. Uh, this is a disadvantage. Advantage uh, for me is uh, uh is maybe um fast connection, uh, fast information, and in in one device you can have different device like a camera, GPS, um, book, library, translator. You have a lot, lot uh, device in one device. <laughs> ah, it's my opinion. Yes, thank you. How I many think, how many think... connectors did he use? Um, no, not three? on three, not on. Yes. Or four, three. Ah, okay. You have to pay attention in your classmates' answer. So pay attention if they are using the connectors or not. In this case, Hector, nice uh, answer, mm -hmm. but the only connectors that I was listening mm -hmm. were like um, and mm -hmm. or those ones mm -hmm. and. Mm -hmm. Or so let's try to include a little bit more. Let's try yes. to use different connectors. That's the Thank purpose. You, okay. Yes. Who's next? Go ahead. Okay. You. Okay, number three. No, what number can... two. Oh, uh, ah, answer number two. for come on. Mm, answer mm, number two. That one. Okay. Mm, in my opinions, um the advantage, the more the devices. Uh, the information uh, is is too fast for the other people. Um, I think. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, for example, uh, you you can you can listen in the in the cars. Uh, you uh, the the connection the other people in the country uh, for example uh, zoom uh, uh, the other platforms no i don't remember uh also also um 
the advising is um Good. Good. Uh, the the cost in the in the the company is is less, it's, it's a few, no no few just mean few. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, no no no, it's a uh, it's a little uh, a little cost a little cost the 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 logistics or transportations. Uh, the the best uh, the best server customer for the for the people. Um, okay. Um, it's disadvantage the devices. Um. Okay. Well, uh, Magdaleno, what are the advantages or disadvantages of public public transportation? Uh, you have to travel stand up every time and in the way in the hours when everyone is going to work. You have to travel stand up almost the time, and you and, have to. Mm -hmm. and, and we we need to mention to the their actual climate or about the hot weather. That is a disadvantage <laughs> for the public transportation. <laughs> yes, thanks yeah. to God, I uh, a few years ago I don't take the bus. Thanks to God, I saw I think so, but it is it is so difficult. You have um, you lost time in the in the public transportation transportation you lost a lot of time a lot of time but we we need to be honest too that is because with you use the public transportation you can um i mean you can because we need uh, right you can produce less um like uh emanations like um, um combustible emanations like the when you use a car that is because you are uh, in you only are in your car and a, a lot of and a lot of be, <laughs> high concerned cars in the in the city they are making a lot of um what is the correct smug. word for that smug smug yes mm -hmm. and and that is very bad for the environment in the for the it's bad for uh, the environment but it's better for me <laughs> it's better <laughs> yeah, yeah. It, it's better it's better to use the the bicycle yeah <laughs> <laughs> and, imagine um, you, imagine you're riding a bicycle a bike imagine you're riding a bike for two miles fabulous. Yes, it's a Salvador mm -hmm. where where there are not um uh walk walk sites. I don't remember oh. what is the word to say that the place next to the road, next mm. to the, the street. What maybe the maybe the teacher walk can site. help us. It's a bike. What is Way what or... is what is the word that you are trying to say? Is that okay. the place the place uh, what is um, at the side, at the side of the road, the street, uh, the street when mm -hmm. where people walk, walk side or well, same something. I mean like the that. sidewalk, the pedestrian sidewalk, okay. it's sidewalk. Uh huh. Sidewalk, sidewalk uh -huh. is the space next to the street uh -huh. that people work on it. Ah, yes. Okay. Imagine in your in your bike. <laughs> 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 it's so funny. <laughs> Yeah, I, 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 oh, it's yeah, a bad idea. I that. That's a bad, a bad idea. idea. With our traffic, I prefer, no, I prefer motorcycle. A, a culture, a culture. Um, <laughs> yes, yes, that's true. Okay. Well, how many connectors did Magdaleno use? Um, I think, in my opinion, he used that more than four connectors. Okay. How about Lucy you Magdalena? Have practice. I don't remember if I use. 
<laughs> I hope so. How about Jamie? Yes. Is Jamie there? No, he's not there. Uh, I'm here, but I have oh, a serious. <laughs> I, have a serious <laughs> I have a serious headache. Oh my gosh. You too? Oh, I'm so sorry. That... Yeah. Okay, Jamie, it's okay. You can listen if you want. I hope you get better soon, okay? Thank you, thank you, me. You're welcome. Okay, uh, I'm going to check another team. Continue, guys, but remember, Lucy, try to pay attention if Magdalena says different connectors. Magdalena, you as well, verify okay. is Lucy is using connectors. The idea is if he use and and he repeats, doesn't count. I mean, he has to use different connectors, not only the same. Got it? Got it. It's pretty good. Continue, please. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, but... Yes, maybe in a Yes. I don't know. What can you say about it? My ideal home. My ideal home uh, will be a uh, second plant. First plant, second plant. So uh, a big house too, because in in my neighborhood Backyard. the home are small, and I don't like it. So in my case, I I prefer a a, a big home with a um, how do you say garden? Backyard. Garden. What? Garden. Garden. Yes, garden. With garden. What about you, uh, Adriana? Um, yeah, my case, um, my ideal like my ideal house look like um as a big house with pool <laughs> and also pool. with um yes and maybe it's with expensive. <laughs> with a big garden too i love trees so maybe with an a big tree in the backyard and i don't know um yes yes uh, th this is my idea house <laughs> with no neighborhood <laughs> Please. <laughs> okay. I don't like How about you, Nelson? Mm -hmm. Let me see my. I think my my ideal home will be with a from big jar. In uh, backyard too, and I would like to plant a lot of tree, and um, I would like to have a a big house, but as Rosalina knows what Airbnb means. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but it's easier. Yeah, that's very yeah, easy. It's easier. After long, easier and long. cheaper than yeah, yeah. I cheaper than a hotel. Yeah. Yes. 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 But not not only hotel. I think that you you can uh, make a reservation in Airbnb. Uh, uh, in Airbnb. Airbnb. Yeah, it's easy now to mm -hmm. to. But yes. it's here, yeah. believe me. Have you ever have you ever rent an Airbnb here in El Salvador? Uh, yes, know. if you want to go to the beach for for example, or or, or mm -hmm. yeah, uh -huh. you can you can get an Airbnb. Yeah, you mm -hmm. can make a reservation by, by internet and but it's easier, yeah. It's easier. Yeah. Yes, it's easier. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nowadays it's easier actually. 
Yes, yes, but, here. Uh, uh, have you ever uh, rent something through Airbnb or through through Booking.com? Booking, yeah. All right, time's up. We are going to go back to the main room. We are going to wait for your classmates. They are still in the breaking room. We are going to wait for them. Time's up, time's up. Let's go back. Aha, very talkative, I like that. All right, we are going to wait for your classmates. They are still in the breaking rooms. Let's go back. All right, very good. Uh -huh, everybody. How was the practice? Easy or difficult? Uh-huh. It's also. So, so, okay, it and was, you guys? It was, it was really interesting. Interesting. Did your classmate use connectors? Yes. yes. A lot. Yes. Absolutely, yes. right, of yes. course. A lot. <laughs> All right, we are going to see. Now you practice with your classmate. Now let's practice with me. I want to listen to you. But before that, I'm going to check attendance one more time. Everybody, if you listen to your names, say present. Adriana Escalante. Present. Okay, cameras, cameras. Carlos Abrego. Carlos Abrego, are you there? Okay, um, Christian Alexander. All right. Christian Alexander. Okay, Erika Jasmine. Present. Okay, Fatima Denise. Present teacher. <laughs> Erika, are you sleeping now? <laughs> no. Okay. no I'm not. <laughs> he is to look inside. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> I'm praying for you. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Uh, let's see. Um sorry, Fatima Denise. Yeah, right. Yes, present teacher. Thank you. Herman Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you. Hector Francisco. Present teacher. All right. Isabel Hernandez. Present, Miss. Okay. Ivan Guzman. Present. Okay. Jamie Raquel. Present. Okay. Holman Saul. All right. Lucy Natalie. Present teacher. Pretty good. Magdalena Escalante. Present. All right. Mirna Elizabeth. Present. Okay. Nelson Antonio. Present. Okay. Oscar Armando. Okay. Rosalina Alvarado. Present. Pretty good. All right. So now we are going to practice. I'm not going to take the timer. The purpose right now is not that you talk for one minute. The purpose right now is that you use three or four connectors, okay? So let's see, do I have a volunteer? <laughs> I mean, no se peleen por hacerlo, right? Don't fight for it. I just need only one. But I okay, who I say wanna, me? I want to be the victim. <laughs> I'm the victim. But I heard someone says me, but I don't know who. I need the name. No? <laughs> okay, uh, who wants to be the victim? Magdalena, do you want to start? <laughs> Yes, 
that's the attitude. Come on. Okay, Magdalena starts, and then he will pick the next one. No worries that if no, if I mean, if you don't pass today, we will have tomorrow. And if you don't pass tomorrow, I mean, we have the full week. So no worries. All right. So Magdaleno, remember, try to use different connectors. Now, by the way, before starting, let's see some little details. If I'm talking about a house that has like different levels, can I say second plan? Second floor? Yes. Second roof. Ah, floor. Mm, plant? No, we say floor. Okay, like a second mm -hmm. floor. Uh, how can I say this in English? Street. Uh -uh. No. You no. see, Magdaleno, it was in your speaking. Side, sidewalk. Thank you. Sidewalk. Oh, yes, this yes, is the yes. little space that is next to the street where people can walk. A lot of tree. Can I say that? Yes. No. A lot of tree. Uh, no. Number three. I'm sorry. Trees. No. Tree. Ah, tree. Trees. Trees. Plural. Okay. Can I say muchos árbol? No, right? Muchos árbol. Mm -mm. It has oh, to be plural. Yo, Have you ever rent? That's my question. <laughs> I didn't say the name. No, but I, I know that question. <laughs> in this case, guys, we have present perfect. So I need the verb in the past participle form. What is the past of rent? Rent. Regular. Rent. Yes. So have you ever rented? Okay. Magdaleno, let's see. I'm going to ask. Okay, why do people travel? Um, somebody of them uh, travel for uh, have fun, for businesses. Somebody travel for pastime for with with their families. Something like that, for relaxed, for rely, uh, for rely with their with themselves. With that, well, sorry, with themselves. For that, different different um, reasons. Everyone have different reason. I think, I think everyone everyone can choose um, why why then they. Why they travel? They don't. They don't. They don't need a lot of money. They don't. They just need. They just need um, uh, feeling, feeling for travel. <laughs> that is my opinion. I don't know if you are agree. If you agree, <laughs> I don't know if you agree. Okay, guys, what do you think? How many connectors did he use? Then. How many? Then. Ah. How oh, many? Mm. Yes. How many connectors? Imagine. I want to think that I'm going to give you twenty dollars per each connector that you use. Veanlo de esa forma, right? Twenty dollars per connector. In this case, Mister, you were saying for a lot. So for this, for this, for this, instead of four, we can combine. Okay, some people travel because, say you got one. Also, da, 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 you have another one, okay? Um, or you can use sequencers. Well, first of all, right? Some people traveled, da, 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 da. Um, then I think ta, 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 ta. so we can use in just in these sentences, you can combine with different connectors instead of avoiding only four. 
past time, instead of saying past time, people past time, what is another verb that I can use? Uh, West, spend. Spend. Mm. Spend. 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 What happens with waste? Waste is negative, right? So spend time is like great, let's have fun. So, and I think you use this one, so that's great. In total, basically, you were using this one and this one. So, Magdaleno, mm, you need little more connectors, okay? You are repeating the same one. So, let's try to avoid that. Pick one of okay. your class. I will give you only $20 because you use I think, <laughs> okay? $20. I mean, something is something. Magdaleno, pick one of your classmates, please. Okay. Um, Victim. Who do you recommend? Who do you recommend to me? The ones with the camera off. <laughs> ah. oh, okay. Um, Holman is my friend. Oh, he's listener. <laughs> it's a name. Uh, it's a name. You can pick Mirna, Lucy, Hector. Ah, Mirna already turned it on. <laughs> ah. Okay, the ones that is not. Which one? Lucy, Lucy. With the camera. Yes, hello Lucy. Hello teacher. <laughs> okay, try to use as many connectors as you can. I will give you $20 per connector, okay? Okay. Let's have money guys. Come on. Payment. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me Lucy, um what can people do to protect the environment? In my opinion, and we can do a, a recycle waste in our normal life. And for example, we can reduce the plastics that, that can use uh, the, in the routines. And that is, that is also for reduce a lot of plastics that uh, finishing our beach or or arrivers on um, and from the nature environments and that is because all this uh, garbage can be uh, very dangerous for the animals or from um, a lot of plants and I think um, we can do more um, healthy uh, like uh, lifestyles and we can reduce also uh, very bad habits from using uh, bikes <laughs> for transportation. <laughs> yes. Only that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How many connectors did she use? Mm, five. Five. I count mm -hmm. a lot. Okay. She used, in my opinion, so she got $20. For example, more other $20. She used and also, be careful with the pronunciation, is rivers no rivers yes, okay rivers space thank you now you use because or i think so one two three four five six seven okay you got 140 if i'm not wrong <laughs> okay a lot of money pretty good so that's what I need, guys. I'm not taking the timer in this moment. I just want you to try to use as many connectors as possible. Easy or difficult to use the connectors? What do you think? Is that easy to include connectors in our speaking? Uh-huh, yes. <laughs> yeah. It's a little difficult because we are not used to. Okay, so we need to practice. Again, you already have the knowledge in your mind. You just need to put it into your mouth. But no worries, we will continue practicing, okay? You will be experts 
using connectors. You will see that. But unfortunately, we don't have more time. So everybody, we're going to stop here. Now we have a winner for today. And the winner is ta -ta 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 -ta, Isabel Hernandez. Are you there? Isabel, are you there? Hello? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I think he's sleeping now. Okay, so if he's not there, Lucy is going to stay. So Lucy, you have to stay. The rest of you guys, you can go to sleep. Have a beautiful night and see you tomorrow. Thank bye. you. See you. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye bye, everyone. Bye. -bye. Take care. Goodbye, goodbye. See you tomorrow. All right, Lucy, how are you? Hi, teacher. I'm very good. Thank you. How are you? So far, so good. I don't complain. Very good with the connectors. Very good Thank job. You. Thank Easy you. or difficult? Well, it's kind of difficult. That is because I don't practice a lot. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? But, but, but you did it great. You used Thank a lot of you. connectors. Now, what happens yes. is that in this topic, what we need to do is like try to think carefully, right? Yes. We need to think about the answers. We need to think about, hey, I need to include this one. How can I include the other one? But it's not impossible. You already did it. Very good. Yes. Yes, so, thank you. Now, this moment is to clarify some questions or comments that you may have. So this is your moment. Yes, I was, um, I have a doubt um, with the um, uh, platform. Mm -hmm. platform. Um, I have in the unit one, a lot of um, questions that are, are wrong. And okay. I don't know why that is because I was trying with um a no uh, a way and another way and thing I don't know. Um for okay. example. Uh-huh. Tell me which ones and we are going I, to verify. I have here the platform. Um oh wait a minute. Um Mm, yes, I have problems with the with the connection, I think. <laughs> I think that one of the issues was in the number seven. Mm -hmm. That is what one of your classmates shared. And in this case, um, it was a problem with the platform. Okay. Ah, okay. Yeah, because even when you put the correct answer, it's mm -hmm. like it take it as incorrect and ah, okay. yeah i already did the exercise and it doesn't matter the answer that you put on it it's always taken as incorrect so um i'm going to share it look at this okay this is the one this is the number seven 1.7 mm -hmm. In this case, yes. you had to put the words in order to type it. In. The number two is always giving you an error. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter the way I try with different ways, but in this case, it's a mistake for the platform. Okay. The rest of the sentences, if you don't have the answers, I can send it to you. Just let me know. Do you have yes, this uh, the rest? Yes, I have the all of the reds wrong. Only the number and, uh, two, right? And no, um, all of the all of that you are sharing right now, I I have I had wrong. Okay, since the number one till this number five. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me help you with that. Do you have the chat open? Yes. 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 Okay. In this case, you have to be very careful. I mean, in the way that you write it, because uh -huh. only one is run, everything will be run. In the number but, two, yes. it doesn't matter because the number two, as I said before, it will always giving you an error. So you can copy it exactly as I'm sending it. 
Okay, and mm -hmm. uh, and for example, that we can at uh, at the moment we use a point at the last of the sentence that maybe a. Uh, that's um, another reason, and, and uh -huh. this is something, and that's why I'm going to report it because in this case, in the previous exercise, it's asking us to add a mm -hmm. point, and specifically mm -hmm. in this one, if you add a point, it's going to be incorrect. So okay. in this case, yeah, unfortunately, it's because of the platform. So yeah, okay. Uh, do you remember the other one? No, I, I I remember I have problems with that sentence only mm -hmm. in that in that unit, and thank you for for your support, and I will um correct correct that ones. Yeah, do it. In this case, remember mm -hmm. just copy as the one as I sent already, so okay. it will be easier for you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. You're very welcome. Thank you for your time. <laughs> My pleasure. So do you have any other questions or comments? Mm, not at the moment. Thank okay, you. pretty good. Mm. So let's stop right here. Thank you so much for staying. Have a beautiful night and see you tomorrow. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye.